how's it going guys and welcome back. In this video, we're going to be checking out how we can exchange our starting weapon for the Krell version. This is needed for the Hard Choices trophy on PS4 and I believe on Xbox it's called Worth It, for some reason the name changes. The first thing we need to do is advance through the story until we defeat the Pan Guardian boss, also known as the Many Faced One. This is the one with many arms and swords. Once we defeat him and come back to the second world crystal, the big root slash tree NPC will break through the door directly in front of this crystal and, and then after completing a few small tasks in this area, we'll get the gem which we'll need to introduce into the eye of the crow. This will open up the door we can see just here. After going through this door, once we get to the top of the stairs, instead of going to the right, if we go into this small room on the left hand side, we'll be able to see the Krell version of whichever our starting weapon was. For me, it's going to be the sword, because I started with the sword class. However, when we take this Krell weapon off of its pedestal, the door will shut behind us, so that we can't leave the room with the weapon. All we need to do is place on the pedestal our starting weapon, and this will replace the Krell weapon's weight, so we can exit the room with the Krell version. However, it is worth noting that the Krell version will start back on level 1, so any upgrades you made to your starting weapon will be lost pretty much. And that is how we get the hard choices slash worth it trophy achievement in Kronos Before the Ashes. I hope you did find this video helpful. If you did, don't forget that thumbs up button, subscribe for more content coming very soon, and we'll see you next time.